Okay, what I have here is a 2020 Chevy Express van. This is a 2500 series, so there'd be a three quarter ton extended chassis. This is a conversion van by the Explorer Van Company out of Warsaw, Indiana. It is a seven passenger conversion van, so it is on the seven passenger on the long chassis instead of a nine. It is a four wheel drive example, six liter V8. Uh, you're gonna have around 8,900 pounds towing on this guy. Uh, the four x four was done by Explorer Van Company, as most of you know. This one has 19,000 and change on it. It's a black with the black out package with so the black wheels, black trim. Uh, gray inside, I believe, if I don't remember correctly. I got it running with all the lights on. Uh, it is in, due in service, so it's in the back lot right now waiting for its inspection from our service department. That will take place and finish up tomorrow on Thursday, the 12th of January, 2023, as of the recording of this video. Uh, this one with 19,000 miles on it does not have much wear. I've been around it a couple times now before I shot the video and I really don't see a whole lot that needs pointed out. So let's get the good stuff and then get up on the inside so you can check it out further. It does have the, it is a limited SE with the X package. So you got the uh, running boards, electronic, do have the step bumper, the fog lamps, bumper covers, all the goodies on the outside and the inside. Uh, this one here does is a little bit extra special, but because it was ordered by someone this way, they don't we don't typically order them as a seven passenger on the long chassis unless someone wants it that way. Uh, a good benefit to this van as well is that it does have the uh, power reclining chairs inside, which I'll show you a little bit uh, in a little bit here, instead of the standard uh, non-power, non-heated captain's chairs. Uh, you'll see a center cap is missing on this wheel that will be replaced today. Uh, it's simply. We have a part sitting on the desk inside of service now. They're just waiting to get this van inside. So I wanted to get this video out to you so you can make a decision on it, but I don't have a whole lot to tell you condition wise. It is just in nice shape. I don't see any damage on the body. Now it is, it is just rain here, but normally I'm pretty good at looking past that. I don't really see anything that indicates there should be a problem. So I'll finish walking around the outside like I said, I don't want to drive it uh, because service is not done with it yet. And that's one of the rules that we have is they're the ones that drive it initially. So I don't want to take it from its parking spot here. It is running. I do have all the goodies on inside so you can see the mood lighting and all that kind of thing. But damage wise, man, there's not a whole lot that we have to do to it. Uh, the wheels look to be all in great shape. Uh, the tires look to be brand new. Um, so if they are original, they, they, they didn't wear on them hard does have the uh, class three hitch with your seven and your four pin backup camera and all that stuff as normal his gray two-tone gray inside and i do shoot these in 1080p so if you need to pause the video to zoom in on something please feel free to do so i don't see any damage yet uh, i don't notice there's nothing funky smelling on the inside i smell the leather and that's about it, it does have your vacuum it does have your three-piece sofa bed let's see how that's working um, this is a brand new arrival to us. First time I've started this van. It's not been detailed. It's not been serviced. This is exactly how we got it in. It does have the uh, three position sofa bed, three person sofa bed in the complete rear position. So it's just like a seven passenger normally would have behind the seat here. You got a lot more leg room in this one, so it is on the extended chassis van, as you can see. Got your mood lighting inside. Got your 31 inch. I think it's a 30 inch TV. DVD player, Apple TV, game console hookup, captain's chairs that are power, and there are the uh, there are the reclining uh, captain's chairs in front. I'll show you. They're really excited about it. They're high 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 dollar stuff. All right, blinds all look good. Uh, this is a winner. Like I said, I don't see any damage to the outside at all. Um, Again, I may miss something because it's got a water spot on it, but that's the kind of stuff we're talking about. I really just don't see any damage whatsoever. So let's get started here up front. Let's have the power boards, lighted step plates, two-tone upholstery. Don't see any problems with the leather whatsoever. No rips, tears, punctures, nothing like that. Like I said, no funky smell. It smells just like you would expect it. A lot more leg room in this van because you are on the extended chassis. And you can see those uh, captain's chairs are power with footstools and recline. I don't know if they're the massage. Uh, yep, looks like they are. I'll show this to you in a minute. The front seats are full power with heat and lumbar support. They are not massage chairs, however. It does have your factory touchscreen navigation, front heat and air controls, 
There's your overhead console for your mood lighting, your lower cabinet ceiling lights, and your fog lamps, as well as rear heat and air controls. It does have your same steering wheel controls, tilt wheel. There's your, uh, let me, I'll get you a better shot of that. Of course, all your seats up front are heated and power. It does have a cooler. The center console does quick release and come out. You also have wireless charging and Apple TV with the smart DVD player. Let's go around the driver's side real quick before I forget to show you this angle. So like I said, I normally do these out on the lot a little bit different, but I don't want to, I can't drive this right now. Here's your odometer reading. It's 19463 at the moment. All right, let's take you in back here. Lines look real good. I don't appear to have any damage on the uh, doors either. No staining on those. Okay, and there's your uh, reclining captain's chairs. And looks like they do have, they are vibrate, massage, pulse, wave, zigzag. So one, two, and three. I'm not sure how to use all this but I'm sure you could figure it out. I know it's working, I can feel that part. Put that here, and I know it has your up, down, standard adjustments, left, right, so they are power. And the footstool and the heat functions are on the side. You have lumbar heat, and then you can adjust for uh, incline and recline, and then your footstool. So you turn your uh, heat on here, Lay that back. There we go. So, and these are also, yeah, they're also swivel. So, they only swivel to the inside. All right, they don't swivel 360 like the other ones in any direction because there's wiring on the bottom of these. So, they only swivel towards the center of the van and then to the rear and then back, if that makes sense but they do swivel. That uh, swivel disconnect is on the inside of the chair right here, okay? If you can hear close, these are vibrating. The massage is going, so. All right, and this one here, there we go. All right. Like I said, not been detailed yet, so it is due. Center console does have your Apple TV, your game console hookup, your DVD player, wireless charging. There's some storage for your headphones on the far wall over there. Let me put these uh, footrests down. So I can see what I'm doing here, get to what I'm doing here. All right, and the lines. You see what kind of shape they're in. Lines are not stained up. My mood lighting's working nice. I got Vista Bay windows. I got a sunroof back here. I got lots of leg room. I don't know if you can see this or not, but it's uh, there's tons back here. Blinds are in shape. Cup holders lit up and working. I've got surround sound, rear heat and air, storage back here. All your blinds are in great shape. You do have power back here also for two uh, five volt outlets here, as well as two more on the driver's side. Also lower heat and air vents down here for your comfort. This is the view from the center section of the rear sofa bed. There's your sunroof overhead. It is a auto close. Ah, shouldn't have opened that, it's wet. Sorry, yeah, let's clean that up. Anyway, there's no water prior to me opening it. <laughs> <laughs> so I probably ought not have done that, but I'll clean that up for you. Um, the rest of it looks really good. It just needs detailed and, and service to finish with it. So I'll get this uploaded and out. Let me know your thoughts and we can go from there. If you're interested in this van or anything else I have available, you can see our complete inventory at 
www.gmcconversionvans.com or contact me direct at 937-440-5793. Again, 937-440-5793. This van is being filmed on the 11th of January, 2023. It is available as of today.